<laughs> hey guys. So I had a free minute when she was awake and I thought I would do our two week update. Um, I guess this will be for me and her. Ooh, let me see where this hair is going. Um, as you can see, she's very bright eyed and bushy tailed. Um, she's waking up a lot more now. Um, she spends a lot more time awake during the day um, that I've noticed. Hi. And um, she's to, like, she, from day one, she's only ever cried when she's hungry. So, um, today we got our first, like, kind of scared, like, because it was all of a sudden just this ear-curdling scream, but she caught herself really good on the head with a fingernail. So, um, we were like, oh, jeez. But, um, she normally only cries when she's hungry. She's such a good baby. She sleeps, or she eats anywhere from every two to four hours. Um, and most of the time, she lets me know when she's hungry. Like last night, I tried to wake her up because it had been like five hours. And um, she just wouldn't eat. So, uh, we're trying though. We're learning. <sighs> she's not had any formula. Um, she's strictly breastfed. Um, I don't know. Her umbilical cord fell off around day six-ish. Um, and she had a slight infection in her, um, not in her belly button, but below it. She, there just one day it popped up a little, um, looked like a little bump, but I didn't want to mess with it because I wasn't sure. And the next day it had gotten bigger. And so I called the doctor and he said to go ahead and come in and he was kind of worried about it, but he was just like, you know, we'll just put some ointment on it and we'll watch it. So we put ointment on it. It went away. She hasn't had to have any other, um, any other sort of medicine or anything for it and um yeah she at our last doctor's appointment weighed seven pounds nine ounces she was still 19 and a half inches long and her head had grown from 33 to 35 if i'm not mistaken um so she's doing good she um is putting on weight like nobody's business she's getting super big um i just I can't believe how much she's grown in two weeks. I they don't tell you that. I mean, I don't know. But um, as for mommy, I am just kind of spotting nothing major. Um, well, just yawn. Now you're gonna make me yawn. Um, <sighs> just kind of spotting nothing major. It's really slowed down. Um, my stitches are healing pretty nicely. Um, we seem to be doing good. We, um, got news today that Daddy's coming home. So that is fantastic. We're super excited. Um, and we are going to be moving back to North Carolina. So, um, we'll see. It'll be fun to be on my own and be taking care of her and, um, just seeing what we can do. <laughs> um been nice having all these extra hands though not having to do my own laundry or anything um are you looking at the camera what are you looking at um yeah it's just been nice um not to have to worry about anything so but she oh oh another thing she has fantastic neck control. I didn't. I know I said that in my other video, but I mean, really, she does. Like, sometimes she'll loll her head around, but for the most part, she can. I, I still support her head. I mean, I stuck out my hands underneath her head, but she tries to pull up. Like, if you hold her hand, she tries to pull up, and she's smiling and she giggles in her sleep, and she's just so. Newborns aren't supposed to do this. <laughs> she's kicking the computer. Um. But yes, we're doing fine, and um, we'll try and keep you updated. I have a doctor's appointment on Friday, and we're moving back to North Carolina on Friday. So we have a lot to do that day. Um, we'll see. Mm -hmm. right, say bye, Zoe. Say bye, Zoe. 